and the cart has very low friction. So I can slide it along this track, and you see it pretty much rolls at a constant velocity. Okay. And then on top of the cart, I have this little device here that I can put this ball in, and I can load it in there. So if you see, there's kind of like this spring-loaded device in there that I can push the ball in, and then on the front of this cart, there's a, a beam here, an infrared beam, that is shot between these two black things. If it gets interrupted by something passing through there, the ball will shoot into the air. So I push the ball down in. Well, let me turn this on first. Push the ball down in, and then this thing has a, th a little thing on it that will pass through there as the cart passes by. So then when the cart goes there, the ball shoots into the air, falls back down in. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll this right with the ball in there. And so it's going to roll by. Ball's going to shoot into the air. Cart's going to keep going at a constant speed. And where's the ball going to land? Back in the cart. Back in the cart. No. Uh, hit the edge. Sometimes I have to line it up so it shoots up straight. If it's not shooting straight, it won't work. We'll try it more time and then maybe I'll have to calibrate it. It was working earlier. There we go. Now I'll do it faster. Try it faster, a little bit faster. You're pushing, you're pushing technology. What's that? You're pushing this technology. In and out. In and out. One more time. In and out again. Are these foul shots? All right. Let's try one more time. We'll slow it down a little bit. Wow, I see the spot there. Okay. Now let's do something different with it. So does that make sense? You want to think about X motion separate from Y. So the cart keeps going, the ball shoots out, it keeps its X motion, and then accelerates in the Y direction, ends up right where it started. Okay? Now, I have a pulley on this end here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach a weight and hang it over a pulley. attach the other end of the string to the cart so that instead of me pushing the cart I'm going to let the weight pull it. Anybody have a prediction for what's going to happen with the ball? It's going to miss? It's going to land. Where will it land? Behind it. Behind it. Let's see. Exactly right. So the cart accelerates, right, keeps getting faster in the x direction, and the ball maintains its x component velocity. So it can't land in the cart because the cart's accelerating away from it.